Спасибо. Good afternoon, dear students. We will continue now the course of lectures for stomatologist and today you will have last lecture the name of this lecture is medical physical culture for the prevention and treatment of occupational disease in dentists dear students please will connect and uh, write down something in the chat of lecture. We'll write down uh, your name, surname, and um, tell me please in the chat about quality of sounds, lecture sounds, and about quality pictures in your computer pictures illustration of lectures questions which we will discuss on today lectures first risks of occupational disease in dentists Next, medical physical culture in the prevention and treatment of neurosis and hypertension. Physical rehabilitation, prevention for violations of posture. Physical rehabilitation, prevention for osteochondrosis of spine. Physical rehabilitation, prevention for flat feet. And next, exercise therapy in the prevention and treatment of arthrosis of the fingers. The professional activities of dentists have some negative aspects. First, it's decrease of decrease of motor activity, hypodynamia or hypokinesia, overstrain, over voltage of the musculoskeletal system during work, increase responsibility and high degree of psycho-emotional stress professional stress of dentists. In result this can be some functional and organic lesions of the cardiovascular and respiratory system. Disorders of metabolic and neurohumoral reactions Result this is tachycardia, hypertension, coronary heart disease, ischemia disease of heart, atherosclerosis, varicose veins, and neuropsychological uh, disorders, neuronal depression. It's result of hypokinesia, nervous, mental and emotional stress. Overstrain, over voltage of the musculoskeletal system due to prolongate body retention in the vertical position. Dentists develop insufficiency ligaments of muscles, bones and joints, flat feet for example. A long stay in the bent position during walk 
especially in people with poorly developed muscles of the body, is the cause of a violation of posture and the development of osteochondrosis of the spine. Most of the working time, the dentist manipulates irrationally thin handles of instruments, which causes overstrain and spasm of the muscles, causing the development of arthrosis and curvature of the fingers, contracture, etc. So now uh, about some core components of cardiac morbidity prevention and cardiac rehabilitation. It's included, first of all, patient assessment, nutritional counseling, lipid management, hypertension management, smoking cessation, diabetes management, psychosocial management, general education, needs, procedures, condition, physical activity counseling, and special exercise training. How you can see in this table, there are some gradation of blood pressure. Optimal blood pressure is 120 millimeters of mer mercury systolic and 80 millimeters of mercury diastolic blood pressure. Normal blood pressure is less than uh, 130 and less than 85 millimeters of mercury. High normal blood pressure is systolic 130 to 139 millimeters of mercury. Diastolic 85 to 89 millimeters of mercury. Hypertension. First stage, mild. When systolic blood pressure is 140 to 159 millimeters of mercury, and diastolic is 90 to 99 millimeters of mercury. Second stage, moderate. Systolic blood pressure is 160 to 179 millimeters of mercury. Diastolic blood pressure is 100 to 109 millimeters of mercury. Third stage, hypertension and severe stage, when blood pressure uh, more or same with 100. 80 millimeters of mercury and more and same with 110 millimeter of mercury just a little blood pressure. High blood pressure is a risk factor for many dangerous disease. <clears throat> From brain stroke cardiac disease, angina pectoris, for example, heart insufficiency, myocardial infarction, renal failure. Blindness, dissection of retina. Uh, hypertension, clusters with hyperlipidemia, diabetes, and obesity. 
Drug have been effective in the treating high blood pressure, but because of their side effects and cost, non-pharmacological alternatives are attractive. Very, very important. And medical physical culture, exercise therapy, and exercise prevention is very, very important in the prophylactic of hypertonic disease. How about pathophysiology of hypertension? Essential hypertension is characterized by increased diastolic blood pressure and related arterial vasoconstriction leading to increased systolic blood pressure. Blood pressure is mainly determined by cardiac output and total peripheral resistance. High blood pressure may be linked to age-related vascular stiffening. High blood pressure is also associated with obesity, salt intake, low potassium intake, physical inactivity, hypokinesia, heavy alcohol use and psychological stress cycle. Two factors uh, always have dentists. It's physical inactivity and psychological stress. And you understand, dentists have high risk, have very dangerous disease, hypertension. Intra-abdominal fat and hyperinsulinemia may play a role in the pathogenesis of hypertension. Prevalence of other risk factors with hypertension. First column is risk factors, second column is percent. Smoking 35%. Cholesterol more than 140 mg per deciliter 40%. It's uh, low density lipids cholesterol are forty percent, but high density lipid cholesterol less than forty milligram deciliters is um, twenty five percent risk. Obesity forty percent. Diabetes fifteen percent. Hyperinsulinemia fifty percent. Sensory lifestyle more than fifty percent. You can will do conclusion that we must decrease this factor for prevention of hypertension and high risk of Severe disease, dangerous for life, disease, the um, small statistic, dear students. It's a very interesting fact. 50% all uh, causes of death is complications of hypertension disease, cardiovascular disease, it's myocardial infarction, it's thrombosis, it's brain stroke, etc. Prevention of hypertension is very, very important task 
for medicine. Uh, increased blood pressure has a positive and continuous associations with cardiovascular events. Bad events. Uh, within uh, the diastolic blood pressure range of 70 to 110 millimeters, mm, millimeters of mercury, uh, there, there is no threshold below which lower of blood pressure does not reduce stroke and cardiovascular disease risk. Uh, 56 millimeters of mercury blood pressure reduction reduce stroke by 34% and chronic heart insufficiency by 19% over 5 years. Lifestyle changes for hypertension reduce excess body weight Reduce dietary sodium to less than 2 po and equal 2.4 grams a day. Maintain adequate dietary intake of potassium, calcium and magnesium. Limit daily alcohol consumptions to less than to drink of whiskey and 10 liters of wine. 24 of beer. Exercise moderately each day. Engage in the meditation or relaxation daily. Sessions of smoking. Pharmacological and neuropharmacological treatment can reduce morbidity. Some Antihypertension agents have side effects and some worsen of the risk factors. Exercise and diet improve multiply risk factors with virtually to no side effect. Exercise may reduce or eliminate the need for antihypertensive medication. Why it's possible? In this illustration, you can see cardioprotective effects of exercise. What happens when person do systematically exercise? It has antisclerotic effect. Decrease the concentrations of lipids, cholesterol, low density and, and very low density, decrease adiposity, increase insulin sensitivity and also have anti-inflammation effect. Psychologically have anti-depression, anti-stress effect and improve, increase social support. No, uh, some words about uh, reasons why disappear lipoproteins of low and very low density and fat in result of physical activity organism takes adipose tissue for receive energy during exercise. In result, this decrease concentration of deposit tissue, um, cholesterols, lipoproteins of high density in the blood. In result, this decrease risk appear atherosclerotic changes and hypertension. Why? Because some scientific investigation proved
a high concentration of lipids increase tonus of resistance vessels, arterioles, which lay down in the basis of pathophysiological pathophysiology of hypertension. We discussed this before. Okay, how about psychological effect? Anti-stress and anti-depression effect. In result of do exercise produce biological active substances such as endorphin, antifalines, which improve mood of person and have anti-stress effects. In result of physical activity, eliminate stress hormones, destroy Stress hormones, it's um, catecholamines and glucocorticoids in the muscles. Destroy more fast than during rest and also decrease stress effect. Also during uh, physical training for made concurrent dominant in the cerebral cortex concurrent dominant for st stress dominant it's also have anti-stress effect and prevention of heart disease hypertension disease next anti-thrombotic effect in result of physical activity increased fibrolytic properties of blood, it's scientific fact. Uh, increase concentrations of antithrombin 3 and heparin in the plasma of blood. It's prevent producing of thrombs. Patel platelet uh, adhesiveness fibrinolysis increase fibrinogen concentration decrease and blood viscosity also decrease. It has anti thrombotic effects. anti-ischemia effect it's increased concentration of oxygen demand in the myocardium improve coronary flow decrease endothelial dysfunction why it's possible because a result of physical activity produce some substances which have vasodilation effect, increased concentration of CO2, nitric oxide, pyruvate, lactate, prostaglandins, in result these release Vasodilation decrease vessel tone and decrease blood pressure. Also have antiarrhythmic effect. Why? Because stimulate vagal tone. Systematic physical training stimulate 
activity of parasympathetic nerve system. It inhibits adrenergic activity and heart rate variability. Also, uh, blood pressure reduce uh, in result of reduction of uh, due to exercise reduction of visceral fat and dependent of changes of body weight alterate renal function to increase elimination of sodium leading to reduce fluid volume it's possible also in result of um, Evaporation, result of sweating, which stimulate physical activity with sweat from human body, remove of sodium ions and fluid. Anthropomorphic parameters may not be primary mechanism in causing of HTM. Lower cardiac output and peripheral vascular resistance at rest and submaximal exercise is a possible mechanism of reduction of blood pressure with exercise. Decrease heart rate Decrease sympathetic and increase parasympathetic tone, lower blood catecholamines and plasma renin activity. Lifestyle activity structure exercise. Its moderate intensity lifestyle activity showed similar or better result versus structured exercise. 4. Improved cardiovascular fitness, reduce body fat, decrease total cholesterol, reduce blood pressure, patient complaints. In, the, in this picture you can see um, different um, patient education tool which can use for prevention and management of hypertension disease. For example, use a fitness video, ride a bike, exercise bike, shoot some baskets, play ball, hockey, golf, go fishing, rafting, swimming, through a Friday to dancing, jump rope, fly kite, work in the yard, garden, rake leaves, move, lawn, plant trees, housework, dusting, vacuuming, painting, working on car, etc. Walk with spouse, family, dog in the morning or after dinner. Get out in nature, play with children, get off bus on stop early, don't use remote control, walk during lunch break, park car in the far end of parking lot, use stairs whenever possible instead to elevator or escalators. Exercise prescriptions for patients with borderline to moderate hypertension. Uh, mild hypertension, distance. Uh, first stage of hypertension we can treat without pharmacological preparation. Only necessary modified style of life and 
stimulate patients for physical activity, correct physical activity, rational physical activity. It's enough for normalized blood pressure. Before we set what uh, requirements for modification lifestyle, that um, we should provide patient evaluation. Look for lipid disorders, retinopathy, neuropathy, renal insufficiency, left ventricular dysfunction, silent myocardium infarction, ischemia osteoarthritis, osteoporosis. Provide exercise testings. And recommend adequate exercise type for this category of people. As usual, recommend aerobic exercise, not the cardiac exercise. <coughs> with high consumption of oxygen. It's low impact activities. Walking, biking, swimming, stepper, treadmill, walking. As usual recommend you can see ski, sky also that uh, recommend this activity during five days week as minimum, better a day, seven days per week. How about intensity? Exercise regime. Start from 50 to 60 percent maximum of, from heart rate. Slowly increase to 70% within six weeks work at 85% heart rate or from 50 to 90% of maximum heart rate. Duration. Start with 22 minutes to 30 minutes per day of continuous activity for first two weeks. Then 30 to 45 minutes a day for next 4 to 6 weekday. Excuse me, for 4 to 6 weeks. And to, uh, 60 minutes a day as maintains. Also, should recommend massage for prophylactic and treatment of this disease. As usually use head, neck, collar zone. It is carried out in the sitting position or lie down positions with sparing techniques, stroking, right, light rubbing. Duration as usually 10 to 15 minutes. Course of treatment 30 20 procedures. Okay, next problem of health which can have dentists, it's occupational disease. That it's um, violence of potion. On this picture, da, you can see some variant this problem. Da, it can be hyperlordosis, more than normally, curve of spine, hyperkephosis, it's more than normally. Uh, curve of kyphosis or flat spine. It's spine without physiological kyphosis, physiological lordosis. Or scoliosis, 
Now you can see all this picture. Deformations of spine in the frontal position can be with rotation of vertebra. It's connect with overstrain, not correct position during work of dentist. How we can prevent and treat this problem? In first of all, using exercise for increased strength and endurance muscles of back, neck, abdominal press, also for correction can use bandage corsets, you can see in the picture. Uh, what's um, the best initial position for provide exercise for prevention of um, posture problems. Uh, if dentists have overstrain of spine during work day, uh, occupational, recommend initial position for exercise, it's light down position, you can see on this picture, can be uh, exercised, must be exercised in the water, it's the best, best variant for dentists, for prevention, not only problem with spine, but also prevention varicose when this problem also very often have dentists. Why? Because long time uh, keep body in the vertical position, have um, high pressure, veins pressure in the veins of low extremities. It's risk factor for precose vein. In this situation, the best type of exercise for relaxation back muscles and training of back muscles and uh, destructions of spine. Uh, dear students, in the water, body weight decreases in the 20 times. Uh, and in the water exercise, it's the best for improve veins blood circulation because um, problem with normal veins blood circulation in the low extremities is risk factors also for varicose vein thrombophlebitis. Swimming. Swimming it's also one of the variant for prevention Hypertension, it's aerobic exercise. Aqua aerobic also should use um, different initial position um, with traction of spine. For example, in the gymnastic scale exercise. Okay. Um, also, for prevention and treatment, rehabilitation patients with violations of posture very widely use massage. In first of all, back region, neck region. Also, it's during 15-20 minutes. 
scan 15 procedure one time per three months. It's the optimum regime for treatment and prophylactic valence of pose. Okay. Next problem, which very widely, unfortunately, have dentists. It's uh, the degenerative changes in the spine. Another name, this is problems, it's osteochondrosis of spine. And have some clinical form. It's dorsal gear back in the pain, the <coughs> lumbar gear, <coughs> back, it's pain in the lumbar part. Cervical gear, pain in the neck. Cervical cranial gear, pain and, pr and pain in the neck and head. Lumbar gear, pain in the lumbar part, sacral region and in the low extremities. Why? Um, what is reason this problem? So we said about this not correct position during work, hypokinesia, uh, overstrain some group of muscles. It's provocate problem with blood circulation, metabolic process in the spine. Without this, for made degenerative changes. And secondary, these changes have negative effect. No? Compress nerves, ridiculous in result, irritate pain. Okay, dear students. Nah, uh, it's really problems, really problems. 95, 99% of stomatology dentists have this problem. <coughs> How it can prevent? It's correct, optimum regime of work with optimal pose during work, which prevent overstrained, not physiological position of body. And very, very important is therapeutic gymnastics or prophylactic hygienic gymnastics. Um, what's principle hygienic gymnastics? I will repeat and will say the best exercise for prevention of osteochondrosis of spine and neurological manifestation of osteochondrosis of spine is exercise in the water. Aqua aerobic, you can see on this picture, illustration, swimming, but also uh, can use different other exercises which increase strength, endurance, muscles of neck, back, abdominal muscles, upper extremities and low extremities. Also for prevention, you can see on this picture, use Reflexor therapy, it's applicator of Kuznetsov. 
it's reflexotherapy equipment uh, which stimulate pain receptors in the skin uh, and reflectory decrease spasm decrease pain sensation in the person and improve blood circulation in the tissues of spine neck back and it can use for prevention degenerative changes in the spine of stepmothers of spine and for treatment um, dorsal gear cervical cranial gear you can see its variant zone which you use on the picture lumbalgia lumbar sugar etc also very widely used massage no understand that if it's cervical gear cervical brachial gear pain in the neck and, the, and in the arm that use for massage colors on an arm if it's dorsal gear use the region of back lumbation gear use lumbar region and low extremity for massage also recommend sleeping on the hard bed with small pillow the best method reflecting its exercise in the water dear students repeat to you okay next problem with health which can have dentists chronic functional overload of the feet leads to static flat feet which progress quite quickly flat feet it's flattening omission of the arch longitudinal and or transverse of the foot on the this picture you can see the variant of flat feet manifestation yeah. what is physiological role of arch on the foot it's necessary for absorption overload <coughs> during walking running jumping but if person haven't this arch or decree this arch of absorption functional of all decrease and of overload um all force gravity force during jumping running pass through low extremities from foot to the joints of low extremities knee joints hip joints and also on the joints of spine and result these dear students persons with flat feet after running after jumping have pain in the joints of low extremities muscles also and back pain also for prevention and treatment with problem what should do should do in first of all use methods of medical physical culture it's hygienic gymnastic now or treatment gymnastic what is main task of gymnastic 
increased strength, endurance, muscles of foot, You can see on this picture some variants, that how it's possible. Also use special equipment, assistive technologies, that, which help formate ligament and muscles appropriate on the low extremities than on the foot. Also recommend walking on the stones, on the sand. Use special bowl for self-massaging. You can see this variant physical rehabilitation in the picture. Also very widely use massage of low extremities, massage of foot. Other assistive technology which very widely used for prevention and rehabilitation patients with flat feet it's special orthosis. Now you can see um, for each person do individually. Now it depends from st stage of deformation of flat and stage of flat feet. Okay, other problem which can have person, dentists, and very widely, unfortunately, have it's arthrosis of fingers. On the illustration, you can see some manifestation this problem. It's connect with specific of work dentists which need um, use an uncomfortable instruments and overstraining of fingers. How manifested this pro problem with arthrosis? Marked by inflammation, it's aseptical inflammation is usually. Pain in joints, muscles, and fib fibrous tissue formation. In result, this it's adversely affect patients well-being, burden for society and health care system, lead to financial loss and productivity, require multidisciplinary approach for treatment and rehabilitation. What is goals of management? Focused on their living pain, prevention, damage, disability, Patient education about the disease, physical therapy for stretching and range of motion exercise, occupational therapy for splints and adaptive device. Treatment should be started early and should be individualized. And uh, treatment depends from stadium of disease. In active phase, as usually 
not recommend um, dynamic exercise, da? but uh, isometric exercise that you can use that. Recommend total body rest, splints, and self management. Isometric exercise. To use physical modalities in this period, cold therapy, ice pot, ice chips, ice massage, cure herbs, is applied to manage acute inflammation, remove swelling, and lessen pain. And recommend orthotics may also help in improving function and reducing pain. Subacute space. Increase repetitions of acting for passive exercise. Progression from isometric to isotonic dynamic exercise. Heat therapy and or massage before stretching may limit muscle spasm and improve tissue flexibility. Ergonomic change use arthrosis, splinting, aquatic therapy. With stable of disease, the remissions. It's use integrate dynamic stretching exercise with resistant ones. Dynamic exercise can increase muscle strength, physical and aerobic capacity. Aerobic exercise should be with 70 to 80 maxim maximum heart rate. Should be started. Low impact exercise such as walking programs, aquatics, dance and cycling and dynamic exercise with resistance are the most commonly used exercise. Exercise therapy can range of motion and flexibility exercise. Health preserve joint movements and are passive when performed by physiotherapists or active when there is patient involvement. Isometric static exercise. Muscle contraction here are achieved without joint movements and lengthening or shortening of muscle fiber. They can be generated with the help of a fixed object like the hand of the therapeutist. A belt, small bell or elastic band. Asymmetric exercise increase strength and resistance and are easy and safe to be performed by patients with inflammatory arthritis. Isotonic dynamic exercise involve changes in the muscle's fiber length through their lengthening, eccentric or shortening concentric nearby joints move through full realm. Aerobic conditioning. Stretching exercise. Moderate intensity exercise are effective. 70 to 80 percent max heart rate equal 220 minus H. And include walking, running, cycling, swimming and stair climbing aquatic exercise also recommend cardiopulmonary fitness exercise Exercise for increasing the with cardiopulmonary fitness exercise for 20 minutes per day, 20 30 minutes per uh, per day, three five days per week. 
you can see um, it should be intensive exercise that with sweating exercise for increasing muscle strength 8 to 10 exercise to increase muscle strength with 80 to 12 repetition it should to perform at least two times per week exercise should focus on damaged structures and should be proceeded by a 5-10 minutes warm up with room exercise flexibility and balance exercise flexibility exercise aim to keep room uh, within the physiological limits they should involve the most used joints are especially important than local inflammation in present or for contraction preventions. They should be performed preferentially every day or minimally three times per week. Balance exercise reduce failing risk. Here you can see some variant of exercise or fingers. Da? And, and not fingers also. Da? Wrist extension, finger flexions, wrist extension, wrist inner outer deviations, tip touch and finger bends, wrist inner and outer rotations, wrist up down uh, bow compressions nemaste exercise reverse nemaste wrist forward and reverse stretch finger adduction right wrist for jar opening left wrist for jar closing it's a illustrated the wrist real inner outer deviation tip touch and finger bands Wrist inner and outer rotations, wrist up down, ball compressions, wrist forward and reverse stretch, finger adduction. Dear students, you can see the schema of physiotherapy, physical rehabilitation, person with this disease. Start from eye therapy at home, basic holding casometric exercise, joint protection routines suggested by a physiotherapist, different modalities, and at physiotherapy center. It was the first stage, the acute phase, but this is subacute stage. Now when you use paraffin wax bath, it's thermotherapy or hot water hand immersion at home can do this. Da? Can use hydrotherapy, customized exercise protocol to improve activities in daily living. You can see um, about the rehabilitation modality for patients with this problem, that with arthritis. Um, very important to remember um, not recommend too long bed rest. Uh, um, the earliest and better should start physical rehabilitation. Can use manual therapy, can use massage very widely. In a situation with arthritis, fingers prophylactic and for treatment, use neck region and 
upper extremities for massage. Can be performed under supervision physiotherapist. Therapeutic is uh, the result of treatment is problem. Da? By patient themselves after instruction, uh, use physical modalities, superficial heat, cold therapy, can use electrotherapy, uses electricity transmitted through the surface electrodes to stimulate nerves and muscles and alleviate pain. Deep tissue heating, ultrasound, diatomy, occupational therapy, learning joint protection and energy conservation methods, making architectural changes, vocational recruitment and self-management. Also for treatment rehabilitation person, with widely used orthosis. Now you can see brasses, splints, corsets, collars, show modification. Use assistive devices, for example, long handle reaches, sock aids, modified eating utensils, bottle openers, etc. <clears throat> no, in this picture you can see some very of physiotherapy. Uh, how provide this? Now uh, can use electrical he heater. Now can use um, ice therapy spark. Now cool. What is Mechanism of thermotherapy. Heat creates higher tissue temperature, which produces vasodilation that increases the supply of oxygen and nutrition and the elimination of carbon dioxide and metabolic waste. Heat therapy is useful for muscle spasm, myalgia, fibromyalgia, contracture, arthrosis, bursitis. Ultrasonic waste work is the selectively superpose the incoming wake and increase the energy of absorption and the significant part of the longitudinal compressions gets converted to the shear waves when they are rapidly absorbed the interface between soft tissues and bone is actually heated now on picture you can see the end of Ozicarid therapy. Thermotherapy, ozicarid. Uh, also, very widely use electrotherapy, use electroenergy in medical treatment. It's used, dear students, methods uh, for prevention and treatment of of disease, occupational disease of stomatologists, which we studied before. As you can see, uh, apparatus for ultrasound therapy. Uh, sound center causes molecules in the tissue to vibrate, thus producing heat and provide micro massage of the tissue. Now improve blood circulation, lift circulation, and uh, trophic process in the tissue. Pain relief can be can use phonophoresis when different anti-inflammatory drugs, for example, hormonal um, guantum, for example, dexamethasone and saturated. Yeah. It's help, ultrasound help inject pharmacological preparation inside of tissue. It's a variant of hydrotherapy. Yeah. Can use for treatment uh, all these diseases. Why is therapy have anti-inflammatory effect? 
pain relief effect, analgesia effect, eh? and also improve trophic process. It's a variant of Ford therapy eh? and it uses uh, infrared laser. No, it's a variant of hydrotherapy. Eh? Hydrotherapy is the part of medicines, particular of naturopathy, occupation therapy, and physiotherapy that involve the use of water for the pain relief and treatment takes advantage of the physical properties of water, such as temperature and pressure, for therapeutic purpose to stimulate blood circulation and treat the symptoms of certain disease. What, uh, in this picture you can see underwater treadmill uh, when combined hydrotherapy with exercise in the water. It's a very interesting variant of hydrokinesotherapy. Also for treatment um, of variant of disease before that what we discussed um, stomatologists and for prophylactic also use magnetic therapy. Also um, very interesting effective methods when you use magnetic wave for prophylactic and treatment uh, purpose goals. For example, uh, magnetic therapy it's very good method for treatment also uh, hypertension and uh, Exciting like emotional stress. Why? Because uh, magnetic therapy stimulate function of parasympathetic nerve system, stimulate dilation of resistant vessels, arteriolis, and have uh, vasodilation effect, decrease arterial blood pressure, uh, but also. Um, decrease new psychoemotional stress, have anti stress effect, and also have anti inflammatory effect for treatment uh, arthrosis, osteochondrosis with neurological manifestation. Bioneotherapy. Bioneotherapy is the treatment of disease by and prevention of them by bathing, usually practiced as spas. While it is considered distinct from hydrotherapy, bioneotherapy may involve hot or cold water, massage through the moving water, relaxation or stimulation. Many mineral waters as spas are rich in particular minerals such as silica, sulfur, selenium and radium. Medicinal clays are also widely used, which practice is known as fungal therapy. No, you can see different variant of balneology. You can use natural water baths, artificial baths with additional, for example, um, essential oils, sun baths, Air baths, mud baths, bog baths, sand baths. It's variant med baths. When you use medicinal med, mud for treatment, prophylactic disease. It's variant of warm therapy, thermotherapy, and heat therapy. And um, Medicine mud have some a reflectory effect because medicine mud have some biological active substances which have treatment prophylactic effect. You can see that bioneotherapy may be recommended for a wide range of illnesses, including arthritis, skin conditions, fibromyalgia. But in heat disease and pregnancy periods can result in serious adverse effect. This indicates in the functional recovery of central and peripheral 
neuropathology, metabolic disease, special diabetes, obesity, and co-chronic disease. Also, available data suggests the balneotherapy therapy may be truly associated with improvement of severe rheumatological disease. Benefits of balneology. Buffing in hot springs gradually increasing the temperature of the body, thus kills the harmful germs the viruses. It increases hydrostatic pressure on the body, which improves blood circulation and oxygenation and increases body metabolism. Climate therapy. Climate therapy refers to temporary of permanent revocations of a patient to a region with a climate more favorable for recovery from or management of condition. It can be aerotherapy, heliotherapy, thalassotherapy, cave therapy, and speleotherapy, mountain therapy. The goal of climate therapy is enhancement of organism improvement of body temperature regulation, immune reactions cortex activity, physical and mental efficiency. Climate therapy can be used very widely and effectively for prophylactic neurons, neurosly hypertension, arthritis also. Thank you for attention. Goodbye. Good luck, dear students.